smithing and armor so that we can upgrade our gear a little bit better but we need to get the strength bobblehead to do that or else I'd have to put a point into strength which I don't want to waste that because uh, you know why not go with a free one so to get the strength bobblehead I do believe we are going to have to find a building in this neighborhood called the mass fusion center so we teleported over here to I think it's called Fen Fenuel Hall and I want to say it is to the west of Fenuel Hall. So let's just start heading this direction. And maybe we'll get lucky. And if not, then we'll just have to figure it out on the fly. And I'm not really sure how long this is going to take. So if we, uh, if we knock this out real quick, we'll go do another Cleansing the Commonwealth mission. Since uh, the Brotherhood has many foes for us to kill. No shortage. But let's just focus on this right now. Oh. Uh oh. Well. Good dead. Look out, Captain Kirk. Well, we found it. We discovered it. Um, is it this one? It must be this one. You assholes. Don't shoot my dog. You're about to pay. Three should be enough to bleed him out. And three more there. Plus, Captain Kirk softened them up for us. Brothers, Semper Invicta! Alrighty. So let's just loot up these gunners real quick and head inside. And you. Yeah. Military cap. I don't think I've seen one of those yet. I wonder what that offers for stat bonuses. Uh, da -da -da. Apparel. Military cap. One to perception. No thanks. No, thank you. Mass fusion building. Here we go. And real quickly, I just wanted to mention that if you watched the last episode, I want to apologize for the background noise in that. I had this awful little static background noise thing going on, and uh, I was able to fix it. There was a grounded wire next to my PC that was causing that noise for some odd reason. Fortunately, I caught it really quickly, because that could have taken a while to fix. So that shouldn't, well, it should sound better in this video. So if you did notice that, I do apologize. We want the quality to be high here on the Wolf Gore channel. We just can't have those shenanigans going on. Yep. All right. Let's take this trap down. Okay. Hmm. I really wish Pew Pew had a suppressor. Oh my, wow, our sneak is really good. That thing didn't see us. Uh, okay. This does have a suppressor, though, so let's go. Oh, that's not a good time to have one bullet left. That's quite unfortunate. Quite. But our sneak is so high that it's not really even causing a problem. Gotta love that. Hmm. Oh, hello. Stab. <laughs> oh my. You should have drank more milk, dude. So what else do we have around here? I also did a little bit more work in Sanctuary, decorated our tree fort a little bit. We can look at that at the end of the episode. Happened a 
lot of fun in Sanctuary. Novice lock, let's go. I'm a master lockpick now. You do not stand a chance, you filthy novice. Yes, reveal your secrets. Cool. Bag of cement, why not? Why not? Excuse me. Excuse me, Captain Kirk. Alright, so it seems like that was just a little old side room. We've got some elevator shafts here. And another. So it must be this direction. Oh, I see a staircase. That's promising. Let's see if there's anything else down here first. Jet. Good. Drugs. Nope. Oh. And what's this? Looks like an elevator door. Anybody in here? Oh, no way. No, I can't. I can't. I was totally willing to do that one for some reason. The game had other plans. Hmm. All right. And lastly, what does this do? ID card. Don't have the card. Oh. Okay. Pretty uneventful so far. Let's try heading upstairs. Oh. Stab. Whoa. Taking off heads. Like I'm popping the cap on some drinks. This is awesome. Who's there? <gasps> oh my gosh, our sneak is so good. This is nuts. Get her, Captain Kirk. Oh. Good boy. Good boy. Anything in here? Carton of cigarettes, right on. Time to hide, boy. Technical documents. Oh, oh, they're closing in. That actually looks like a trap right there. So what activates it? Hmm, nothing. It would seem. It's a Tesla coil above us. Man, these guys aren't fucking around. The wind. Let's see what's behind this novice lock. Ah, oh, damn it. Here we go. Yes. A pack of duct tape. Wunderbar. Was that? Oh, hello. My god, how are you not seeing me, bro? Well, maybe you should have got your eyes checked before you joined the gunners. Just putting that out there. More technical documents, good. Hi. Oh, get up. Yeah. Get down. A bayoneted missile launcher. That's quite the intimidating combination. Hmm. Why do I... I see a red blip over here. Are you... Did you walk past me? No? Hmm, suspicious. Oh, you must be above me. Ah, hello! Hello, my friend. You just alert everybody. You dick. You dick. <laughs> How do you like my stabbing arm? He didn't like it. I suppose we could take that rocket launcher. They're probably pretty valuable. One would assume. Hmm. 
Nope, just a hole in the wall. So sneaky. Much sneak. <laughs> oh, you dicks. You dicks. That was very rude. Very rude indeed. Wiping them out and they don't even realize. Works for me. Ooh, a teapot. Cool. It was cool. That was like a full on takedown. Ah! Uh oh. Run away! Ugh. It's worth bearing in mind that we are kind of a glass cannon. While we do glorious damage from sneak, we cannot take very much punishment. Oh, hi! I'm on him! Oh, legendary! Stay down, bitch. Ooh. Let's go for headshots. Let's see what this baby can do. <laughs> oh my gosh, this 10 millimeter is so good. Uh, just a shitty safe cracking. Excuse me. Excuse me, Captain Kirk. I'm trying to loot here, buddy. Muffled fiberglass combat armor. Right leg. You know what? That might have some upgrades that we can swap to our current right leg. Something I've been meaning to uh, try. Because I do not know. But you can do it with guns, so I would assume you can do it with gear. Right? Swap mods. That's it. Eh. I'm okay without that stuff. Take this alarm clock, though. Out of my way, screwdriver. Huh. So where's that go? feel like going down is counterproductive. That's what he said. Uh, oh, shoot. Uh, was that anything? Sighted hair trigger combat rifle. Eh, maybe. Maybe. Maybe there's something there. Yup. Come on, boy. Oh. We're not out of the woods yet, chaps. More to kill. Oh. Is that a jump we're gonna have to make? Mm. Hey, oh. oh, so close. Let's try that one more time. Woo! <laughs> the camera's a little janky, but did you see that? That was awesome. Critical strikes from behind. I didn't even know that was a thing. God, I love this game. Hey, oh! That was a bad jump. I think we can do this. I think we can. I think we can. Oh. Excuse me. 
Yes! Oh, I Bethesda's I Bethesda my way up. <laughs> I hope that becomes a verb now. Bethesda my way up. There's some buff out hitting in there. And a 20 pound dumbbell. That's freaking random. Bet it weighs 20 pounds. Razor grain. <laughs> Razor grain in a lunch pail. <laughs> I packed your lunch today, honey. Here's a stock of razor grain. Oh my. What a satisfying meal. Ooh. Why not? Why not? Oh, that's just a big old hole in the ceiling, isn't it? Hey, how'd you get in here? such a genius. You and your dog magic. You're a wizard, Captain Kirk. Yo, oh. Good jump. Good jump. Technical documents. Fantastic. else in here. Alright, let's keep heading up. Oh, this really opens up. So there's a door there. Door there, but that has an out of order sign on it. Did I just see some power armor walk by? Gonna quick save it up, because I don't feel like redoing this. Sorry, I didn't catch that. One, one more time? Okay, we'll talk later. Oh, okay, maybe, uh... Maybe not. Maybe not. Oh, crap. Oh, oh this isn't good. Oh, at least we disarmed him. That's, that's good. Get back. Get back. Oh, you are serious. Fuck, you know that? Really? I am. Because you should have worn a helmet. Damage as I was hoping. Uh oh. Uh oh. He got a gun. He got a gun. Let's introduce this you fool to really terror. Terror. Uh. terror. You know nothing, fool. Crit. There we go. Stimpack. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Hey, Captain Kirk, you asshole. I'll kill you. I will kill you. Yeah. Yeah. Go down, bitch. My god, you are strong. I really wish I got a sneak attack on you. Forty-one percent chance. Do we believe in ourselves? Crit. Yeah. <laughs> right through the eye. Good boy. Good boy. Plasma cartridge. Recoil compensated. Thirty-eight. Nah, revolver garbage. Plasma pistol. And uh, oh darn it. We're carrying too much. Let's eat some rad stag, and uh, that should. Should be enough to get us out of here. Real rad stick. There we go. So that just uh, gave us a carry weight buff for a short time. I think we reached the top. And if I do recall, ha <laughs> ha! There it is. Strength bobblehead. Perfect. Your strength has permanently been increased by Juan. Eins. Sure. Okay, you are out of order. This whole courtroom's out of order. Ooh, it's 
right. Ooh, mini nuke, awesome. Another alarm clock and some wonder glue. Muffled shadowed metal right arm pocketed. I eh, don't need any of that. Since we're already full up, no point in bothering. Let me see a door here and here. So what is behind these? Oh, balcony. Oh my gosh, that loading screen though. Hey, can somebody buy me a PS4 Pro? Because that would be... That would be awesome. I want one. Oh, hello. Thumbnail! Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. Maybe there. That's kind of cool, too. Oh, yeah. God, I love thumbnails. Well, I should clarify that. I know thumbnails are incredibly tedious, but I love getting thumbnails while I'm making the episode. That is efficiency. This is an industry of efficiency. Hey! Come on, boy. No dog magic today. You're just gonna get on the elevator with me. Hey, boy. Hey. Wait there. Oh, no, that's not what I meant. How you doing, buddy? I just wanted to talk. Hey, boy. You know any tricks? You know any tricks? Bobby. <gasps> good job, Captain Kirk. You're such a good boy. You're coming, right? I didn't mean to tell you to wait. That was a lie. Okay, you're waiting. Hey. Come, Come on. Come on. Come on, boy. Wonder. Hey! Got some loot from that thing we killed at the start. Hey! Who the fuck do you think you are? Oof. Oh my goodness! There we go. I won't turn down a little extra experience. Just fine by me. So that's the exit, then what's this? Presumably just another exit. Okay. Well, that went well. We got the strength bobblehead we were looking for. And I think we're going to hold off on doing another quest this episode. Just because we are already coming up on 30 minutes. But why don't we pop back to Sanctuary and just kind of check some stuff out together? Alrighty, chaps. We're back in Sanctuary. Why don't we pop open our pit boy and put this perk point into uh, I'm not sure uh, armor or blacksmith. So now that we have access to blacksmith, let's. Mm, that's tough. That is tough. I'm gonna give it a minute. I'm gonna give it a minute. I'm gonna check the the stations and see which one would actually be better for us right now. Let me run up to the tree fort and show you guys what I was working on in between episodes. Yeah, da, 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 da. The next person that asked me to shag is getting a well-placed kick. <laughs> oh, Kate. Hey, Mama Murphy. So yeah, this is our little tree fort. I went ahead and decorated it. Um, it's lit up quite well. Everybody's got candles, lanterns, a personal light for their room. I kind of wish I could put up wall dividers, but eh, what can you do? We're all getting to know each other well. And I love, I love this. This this just came to me. This couch setup with the ferns and the fireplaces and stuff. Oh, I love it. I love it. It looks so cool. Yeah, this is our tree fort. I think it's pretty freaking awesome. I'll try to make myself useful. No one wants to see a grown man feeling sorry for himself. True story. Shut the fuck right. up, bro. Hey, boy. Don't talk to him. He's annoying. Alrighty. So, I'm going to take a look. Um, I'm thinking probably armor will be better. But I'm going to take a look, and we'll be right back. Okay, chaps. So, I'm thinking uh, we're going to invest into armor first, because I did check it out. And actually putting points into Blacksmith, while it will help us in the future, won't really do anything for us right now. So we're going to put one point into Armorer, 
and see if we can uh, upgrade our weapons a little, or our, uh, our armor a little bit. That makes more sense. It's clear tonight. So let's be able to pull out our cryogenic right. painted metal chest piece. So we had painted metal. Oh, that is much better. Much, much better. So alloyed metal is going to give us quite a bit more resistances. But if we went with shadowed metal, while we would get less bonus to resistance, we would be better at sneaking in dark areas. Honestly, our sneak is so good that I'm going to go with uh, the alloyed metal. And then our mod slot. We can now do... I can't... Oh, I need fiberglass for that. Okay, so we can do asbestos lining. Immune to being set on fire. Yeah, I like that. I really like that. That uh, that flows well with the whole cryogenic concept. Yeah. Who wants to be set on fire anyways? Now we don't have to worry about it. Alright, so that takes care of our chest piece for now. Here is our metal right leg, plus one to strength, one to endurance. And we can kick that up to alloy as well. So let's do it. And... Rather than pocketed, reduce falling damage or reduces limb damage. I think reduced limb damage would be good. We do tend to uh, get messed up pretty bad when we're fighting in melee. Get crippled. Here's our vault suit, and it looks like we're going to need armor 2 or higher to be able to improve this again. Hmm. All right. Here's our other leg slot. Uh, so that one actually already had a nice upgrade on it. Yeah, let's see. Brotherhood of Steel would give it more radiation protection. This is 10 and 10. Oh. oh, that's tough between these two. But I think this one edges it out a little bit. 10 and 10 versus 8, 8, and 15. But gosh, that number difference. Actually, I think we're going to go with Brotherhood of Steel. Because that's, that's just a total of, of more resistance, which I like. And it's already muffled. Reduces detection from moving. Oh, that's great. That's just great. We're going to leave that one on for sure. Here is our right arm. Reflects 10% of melee damage back on attackers. And it doesn't look like we can do anything else with this, other than maybe, no, no, strengthened is good. Once again, reducing limb damage, just keeping us a little bit safer. And then we've got the Sentinel's leather left arm, which reduces damage while standing. And not moving. Weird. Never a Let's make it sturdy. Just increasing re resistances. Mama Murphy. I'm very Can we talk? No, he's not asking you. Let's strengthen that one as well. Like Lastly, we've got our girdled leather left leg. You have the sight. Studded yeah. leather increasing Can resistance. And one more time, strengthened, so our limb resistance should be significantly higher now. We shouldn't be getting crippled so often. Alrighty, chaps, before we wrap it up for the day, I decided to take off my Molotov cocktails from my quick action bar, because I was never using them. And I'm going to throw on this legendary shotgun that we got, I think, in the last episode. It's quite strong, actually. Uh, not quite best in slot, but 75 damage a shot, and it's got a bayonet for close range. Sounds good, I think we can use that. Let's go over its mods real quick. So it's got a calibrated powerful receiver, pretty darn good. Short ported and shielded barrel, pretty darn good. Full stock, pretty good. Quick, e quick eject mag, pretty good. Glow sights, and a large bayonet. All things considered, I like it. And we renamed it the Elephant Gun in honor of our first shotgun. But... Here it is. Let's see what it looks like. Ooh. Oh, that's cool. I like it already. 
and it's got eight shots. That's awesome. Absolutely awesome. Alrighty, chaps. Well, I think that's where we're going to call it for today. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's episode, hit that like button for me. If you'd like to leave a comment, it does help the channel grow. And if you'd like to subscribe for more of my content, I'd certainly appreciate it. Either way, I will see you guys back here next time with